Hello everyone, it's An here and welcome to video number 9 in the series How to Build a 3D Printed Jumbo Jet Engine Model. In this video, I'm going to show you a very cool upgrade that I've done to the model recently. As you can see, the fan now can turn itself and I don't even need to touch it. So, let's go find out how is it even possible. Are you ready? to know the secret of this spinning fan. So, the fan is driven by a very small, tiny little motor which is hidden inside the exhaust nozzle which I'm going to show you in a little bit. But what is cool is you can see not just the fan but all the other blades are spinning as well. So you've got the IP compressor blade spinning, the HP compressor blade, the HP turbine, the IP turbine and the LP turbine, they're all spinning. Okay, I'm gonna switch off the motor for a little bit just to show you what is inside the exhaust nozzle. Okay, so let's see then. I'm just gonna remove the exhaust nozzle for a little bit so you can see what's inside. Right, so. So this is what I have added to the model. Let me just remove that. Okay. So I found this tiny little gear motor on Amazon the other day. Let me show you. It is a very, very small motor. When I bought it, I didn't even know if it would work or not. But I bought it anyway, and it turned out it was perfect for the 3D printed jet engine. So I was really, really pleased with what I purchased. The other thing that I bought on Amazon is that um, battery box here because I needed 6 volt to power this gear motor so if I remove this cover you can see um, basically it has 4 AAA battery inside 1.5 volt each so in total you've got 6 volt now the very good thing about this battery box is if you see the other side it actually has a switch here as well on and off so you can actually turn your gear motor on and off which is perfect now i have the motor and i have the power supply what i need to figure out is how to put this motor into the jet engine model and spin the fan that's why I decided to design and 3D print it two little things. Uh, the first thing that I designed and 3D printed is that uh, adapter over here. So this adapter basically connects the LP shaft with the uh, little shaft on the gear motor. And the th second thing that I designed is this motor holder here. So basically what it does is it just holds the motor um, in the right place um, so it can spin the LP shaft um, you can probably see that it taper to one end because I want this to center itself while when it is located inside the exhaust nozzles so if you push it in it will just stay just like that finally let me give you a very quick demonstration how to set this up so firstly what you have to do is just insert that adapter into the gear motor you can check whether it's spinning or not it's spinning as you can see right so now what i want is i want to locate this and make sure that it engage with the lp shaft um, just like that and then just stick this in the base for now like that. Right. 
and what I want to do is just um, connect the exhaust nozzles to the engine just like that. It's all done. Now what you have to do is just switch it on. Simple as that. And this is the upgraded version of the 3D printed 3 shaft jet engine model. Thank you.